All right, this week's Athlete of the Week, Southern High School wrestler Asia Tapasna, and winning your second All-Island Gold Medal this season for your high school career. But uh, walk us back and uh, tell us how you got that, that fight and that drive and uh, determination early in your life. I went through a lot when I was young. Um, I just, I, I've always had that motivation uh, from my parents to always just keep going and to never stop. Because I, I refuse to lose. I don't want to lose. I always want to be on top. And Cancer survivor, let's, let's talk about that yeah. battle early in your life. Okay. Um, when I was five, I was diagnosed with ganglion neuroblastoma, which is actually a tumor next to my heart. It was like the size of my fist. And that was, I had no idea like what I was going through at the time, but it was pretty serious. And then when I was seven, I was diagnosed with leukemia. And that's as I got older, it was just like, I, I realized that, you know, this is, this is real, like I'm going through this and I need to fight, I need to keep fighting. The first time you got taste for wrestling, it was stateside, but you were training alongside boys. You weren't able to step onto the mat until uh, attending Tees and High, okay. where you took the 107 pound title mm -hmm. uh, for the All Island Meet. And uh, transferring over to Southern High, how has that been? Oh, uh, it was awesome. I love it there. It's very, like, people are very nice. And the hospitality there. Yeah. So going undefeated uh, your junior season and now uh, at Southern High finishing this year's season undefeated as well taking gold in the 112 pound division but also winning Southern High's first ever uh, team title for the girls division. Yeah that was that was what I wanted to do. I wanted to motivate the girls to do that as their captain and I, it was amazing. I wasn't expecting it really but it was it was the best thing that's happened to me honestly one of the best things four girls taking gold another four girls getting on the podium um talk about the team and, and how uh this year's girls team was able to pull off that that championship win we are like a whole hype train so once like we get on the mat everyone's like in it and they're just like motivating each other and cheering each other on Everyone sees it. I mean, I think we're like the most hyped team in the league. Yeah. Your coach has been a big uh, part in the team's success, oh, yes. and um, how has that been? Just you know, buying into what he was preaching and um, seeing the success uh, you guys had this season. Um, he was. He was part of the big hype train. Honestly, he's always, you know, motivating us and telling us we can do it and to never tell ourselves that we can't do it because honestly we could and we just kept that mindset a strong mind and we did it you definitely have to have that fight in, in, in within yourself so um what advice do you have to any other student athletes out there that uh, may be going through something in life having set a goal for yourself and just continue to push forward and you know being able to achieve that I know it sounds cliche, but to honestly never give up it's, and to motivate yourself and to never, j just never stop because when you need to like tell yourself, I want to be on top. It's not always like, I just want to be in it to be in it. You, you always want to keep telling yourself to be on top. Yeah. Who do you want to donate your check to? Uh, I will be donating my um, check to Make-A-Wish Foundation.